the weather in Bangkok as you can see it's raining almost every day from now till Wednesday it's raining and it's 30 degrees it's so hot so humid and it's raining almost every day Yesterday I was attending an event at Siam Paragon and when I wanted to come back home with the BTS it was heavily raining. The weather was crazy, thunderstorms, flooding. So we've got stuck on the BTS station around 30 minutes because you cannot go down. The rain is so heavy. That's the situation these days in Thailand. And this vlog is about to tell you what to expect if you are coming to Thailand soon. Now one of the good things in Bangkok when it rains that you can spend your time in the closed malls, markets, no problem, lots of indoor activities or maybe have a massage session. But what happens to the open markets? So this week I was in one of the open markets, the cheapest markets in Bangkok located in Chinatown and suddenly the weather started to rain heavily this is the problem that the weather is unpredictable you go out it's sunny and in 10 minutes 20 minutes the weather will be disaster so what happened at the market that all the shops start closing some of them covering the items so the shopping experience is not great these days especially if the weather is bad One of the worst ideas is to go out with a scooter when it's going to rain. Now let's say it's not raining, as you can see people are holding umbrellas. That's another story because when it's not raining, it's so hot and humid and the sun is very harsh. So if you want to go out, it's better to go out in the afternoon. At daytime, it's a very bad idea to be outdoor unless you are going to spend your time at the malls and the markets so that's another story it's not about the rainy season it's also about humidity the weather is so hot at the same time so humid but as i said if you are coming to thailand there are lots of positive things these days i'm gonna tell you one of them is that the hotel prices are so cheap these days. If you are going to book a hotel, even in a five star, then the prices are so cheap. There are lots of promotions. Last week we have stayed in a five star hotel with breakfast. It was only $50 per night. So that's one of the positive things these days if you are going to stay or if you are coming to Thailand soon. Now another thing guys that the internal flights, the domestic flights are so cheap these days. So imagine from here, from Bangkok to Phuket, two ways, only $35, $40 sometimes, of course, if you get the promotion. Usually if you want to book domestic flights, you can save if you go very early so if you are going to book it let's say you catch the flight at 8 a.m in the morning then it's very cheap last time it was only 1200 thai baht both ways the flight was at 8 a.m and we were at phuket around 9 30 only for 1200 baht so we have to cross the road now you have to be very careful while you are walking driving scooter whatever you are doing in Bangkok all right here we are safe in one piece and also there are places you cannot drive a scooter because as you can see it's <laughs> very crowded lots of people so traveling to Thailand in the rainy season is not a complete bad idea as you can see there are positive points the hotels are so cheap 
The internal flights, the domestic flights are so affordable, so you can explore Thailand more, stay in five-star hotels. But of course, if you are not annoyed by the rain and the weather. But as I said, it rains every day, but not all the day. And of course, you have sunny days too. Now, another positive point, guys, if you are coming to Thailand, that the promotions these days at the malls and the markets, the prices are insane. There are lots of promotions till 80% on original brands. So if you love shopping, then you can buy too much these days with very good prices. Along the way, you can see that it's getting darker. So hopefully we can end this vlog soon before it rains. I am heading to visit my friend at Prompong station. So hopefully we can make it. Now another positive point may be positive for some people and negative for others that as you can see from the pictures, it's much more calmer these days. So if you like calmer atmosphere, this is the time guys. You can see now we are heading to Prompong. This is a touristic area, lower Sukhumvit, and almost the streets are empty. Now, of course, it's going to rain, that's one of the reasons. But wherever you go these days, even the nightlife is not so busy. So, some people love the calm atmosphere, some people love to be busy, the hustle and bustle. Now, I'm going to talk about the south. If you are heading to Phuket, to the islands, what about there? If you can do the boat trips, let's say it is also raining too much. I have an update yesterday from Phuket that it was raining almost all day. And when it rains in Phuket, especially in Patong, then there is nothing to do. So if you are heading to Phuket these days, that's also the situation. Moreover, moreover, the boat trips, if you are going to have boat trips, I want to talk about two points here. If you are going to take the boat trips, first of all, the prices are so affordable because it's low season. So you can take a boat trip, which is usually 2000 baht for 1000 baht. But the negative point is that if you are not lucky, the weather will be so harsh, the waves, so riding the speedboats in the low season is not too much fun. So that's another thing. At one point you are saving, at the second point it's not too much pleasing. So if you like to save, this is the time. But if you like the best weather, best experience, then this is the worst time. So here we are guys, this is Prompong. We've made it and it's not raining. As I said, the weather is unpredictable these days. In Bangkok, although it's so cloudy, gray skies, but it's not raining. Now, of course, once you go out in Bangkok, whatever the weather is, always keep a hat and sunglasses with you because it's so hot. Once it's sunny, it's not funny. That's the point. But check what I have in my bag. This is my raincoat. Always nowadays have a raincoat with you. It's not heavy. So once it rains, it will save a lot on you. You can walk, no problem. Even if it's flooding. Another thing you can have such a cover for your bag. You have valuables in your bag, money, cameras and such things. So this is a cover that will protect you from the rain. So these two things always now with me in my bag. If you are going out, keep it with you too. And as I said, whatever the weather is, protect yourself from the sun. It's so hot, so humid. So that's the story if you are coming to Thailand soon. It's rainy season. But of course, as I said, there are lots of positive things. You can be happy with it, saving, 
and buying a lot, traveling a lot, exploring around because the domestic flights are so cheap, the hotels are so cheap. So I hope you enjoyed this vlog. It was a short vlog with no fancy introduction or anything. It was just updating you and putting you in the real situation. If you are coming to Thailand, this is it. This is what to expect. No problem if you have already booked your flight. This is it. You're gonna enjoy the sun and the rain. Thank you for watching. Stay tuned and see you on Saturday.